All right, here we're going to talk about the anterior cerebral artery. We're going to talk about what it supplies and what a stroke would do. Here we go. So here is a picture of the anterior cerebral artery, what it's supplying. We see it's supplying the middle line of the brain in the frontal lobe and the parietal lobe. So it's the middle line, okay? And that's why we note, it's, see, this is a cross section of the brain. The yellow here, the yellow, is going to be for the anterior cerebral artery, what it's supplying, this portion over here. Okay, and then we note on this guy's brain, this guy over here, he is the anterior cerebral guy because he's got an ant on his cerebrum for anterior cerebral guy. Anterior cerebral artery, so the yellow over here is the anterior cerebral portion. In the next video, we'll talk about what's in red over here. The red over here is the middle cerebral artery. But the yellow is for anterior cerebral artery. And a stroke, what it would do is, see so he's looking down to the opposite side over here. Because the anterior cerebral artery, a stroke, what it would do is, it would cause a contralateral paralysis and sensory loss on the lower limb over here. So you see the lower leg? He has contralateral paralysis and sensory loss. He's very sad because he can't feel his leg over here and he can't move his leg over here. And we also note that he urinated on the floor because urinary incontinence is also associated with anterior cerebral artery stroke. Okay, those are the important things we need to know. All right, take care.